let's get into nutrition is not my number one area of focus, but we want to be comprehensive. And these are some key areas that we do feel very comfortable to share with you. Um, you know, more fruits and vegetables, you know, whole grains, lean proteins, uh, and healthy fats, right? Pretty, pretty uh, self-explanatory there. You've probably seen that before. Um, and work with a nutritionist or dietitian, you know, on some of these things. Um, also, in general, and I certainly have found my challenges over the years, different times where, you know, I would not eat. And the reality was I was actually gaining weight while not eating because everything I would eat, my body would just store, would store it as fat. So then it was just a mess. And I find the people who are eating smaller meals more often through the day, one, you know, they're just in general a, a bit more fit and, and active and probably have a better metabolism and energy level. Um, they're probably doing other things in their life that are also more healthy along those lines. Um, but yeah, don't, don't skip, uh, don't skip meals. Um, and the more that you can fit in some of those smaller meals, it's going to keep your blood sugar levels more consistent, um, help your focus, make, maybe make your workday go a little bit faster, feel, feel more productive. Uh, so who knows, maybe you can do more and less time. Uh, which is never a problem for any of us, I think. Um, you know, have healthy options wherever you go, whether it's in your car, at your desk, at your house. Um, careful to stay away from the junk stuff. Um, stay hydrated, right? We want to make sure that um, you're drinking, you know, what is it, six to eight, uh, eight ounce glasses of water, you know, every single day. So really, you know, continuing to hydrate probably more uh, than you than you think uh, you should. Um, Seldom do I find people overhydrate uh, and then move, right? So if you are back at the office, um, take the stairs, you know, do some squats at your desk, go through these stretches that we've just gone through. Um, if your water bottle's, you know, empty, go take the opportunity, go and go and refill it. The more you refill it, the more often that you might have to go to the bathroom. Um, go ahead and stretch, really, you know, stride out when you're, you know, walking around and things like that. So utilize that as good you know, um, breaks that you're almost forced to have by actually taking care of yourself. So uh, I hope these trip tips and tricks are helpful. Uh, and then here's just some other ways that, that Breakthrough helps people all over the world. So we develop um, customized HR uh, programs for HR departments for different benefits, um, health and wellness and ergonomic evaluations for onboarding, you know, ongoing situations, trying to prevent um, people from being out of the office unnecessarily, uh, helping them um, just to be, you know, more successful, more productive, save money and time on uh, medical appointments, help them navigate the medical system, trying to help them not, you know, put, you know, get to the right doctor. So, for example, you know, someone might have, you know, like a 14-year-old daughter who's having knee pain. So, rather than calling the pediatrician, you know, we might suggest that you call the orthopedist and then have the orthopedist report back to the pediatrician or go straight to a physical therapist. A lot of people don't realize they have direct access to physical therapists. So uh, through one of the virtual sessions, we might be able to help you figure that out, help you find a good physical therapy group close to you within your network or potentially even going out of network. Because we've learned that a lot of times when people go in network to a hospital based facility, they will spend a lot more, three to five times more than they would pay by going out of network to a private clinic. And I certainly had that issue years ago when I had to get a sleep study for my CPAP. Again, I told you that my wife is amazing and has dealt with me for over 20 years. Uh, well, married for over 20 years, so she's dealt with me for even more than that. Um, but you know, to be able to get, you know, go through a sleep study. And that was just a whole scenario that because I knew all the questions to ask, I was in a good situation and prevented, you know, really significant expenses based on a hospital-based facility as opposed to a private facility. So that applies for, you know, orthopedics and um, sleep studies and all sorts of specialists. So it's good to be able to know that. Uh, we do lunch and learns on different topics, such as, you know, ergonomics, uh, injury prevention in your adolescent athlete, healthy pregnancy, fall prevention, vestibular, um, pelvic floor situations, Parkinson's, all these different things. Um, so always happy to help there. Physical therapy. Um, if you're local here, uh, we are in Sunnyvale, California, so in the north, north um, Silicon Valley. Uh, so if you're here, then we do, you know, 40-minute sessions and things like that. Otherwise, virtually we do 
um, 25 and 50 minute sessions for people for different reasons. And our care team is more than happy to kind of help you figure out, you know, what the right solution is for you. And even if it's not with us, then we're happy to kind of get you in the right location. Um, it's really truly about um, collaborating with you and, and helping you navigate the system and get to your goals, get from wherever you are to wherever you want to be as quickly and cost effectively as possible. Our medical system is um, certainly in need of, of help. Uh, I can't fix it, um, but uh, our goal is to help where we can. And then we have wellness and sports performance programs for people of, of all ages, so customized plans to really help people uh, get to that next level. So people who don't need medically necessary uh, physical therapy services, uh, then we uh, are able to see them with their health and wellness goals. And um, ideally, uh, one, to really get to their big goals, but two, to help keep them out of the medical system. So really a true preventive, uh, all-encompassing, comprehensive approach that we've got. Uh, and then HR consulting. Uh, because of our experience, because of all the different HR professionals I work with, business owners, executives, uh, our team is able to develop these custom uh, programs for uh, them. We've been able to work with some great groups. Uh, we actually just shifted our 401k plan last year and it's saving us a ton of money and time. And so that's been super helpful for us. I'm happy to get anyone in your HR department connected with uh, great groups of people there. Um, if you're looking to figure out best ergonomic equipment and things like that, uh, we don't typically monetize that, but I'm happy to be a, a resource for you um, on any level to make sure your onboarding process is smooth and the people uh, on your team really know that you care about them. 